Hello there and welcome to today's Helpful Hint. What I want to talk to you today about is that belief that if you create more content that people will find you online. Let me tell you, that's a joke. It's a fallacy and it ain't true. That's what I want to talk to you today about, right? My name is Peter Beckenham for PeterBeckenham.com, also known as The Village Marketer, right? And as always, talking to you from my Thai village, way up near the Cambodian border. So apologies for the background noises of the chickens and the dogs and the buffaloes, etc., right? That's what it's like here. But let's get back to this fallacy, this belief that some of you, and maybe you have, that if you create content, people are going to find you. Ain't true. Let me burst your bubble by saying, doesn't matter what you create, right? Nobody's interested. Sounds harsh, but it's true, right? They're not interested. What you've got to do is create interest. What you've got to do is create a situation where people can find you, can at least look at what you're prepared to offer. Look at who you are, what you stand for, what you're prepared to do, how you're going to go about it, all those things, right? So this is what you have to do. Firstly, be clear. Who are you trying to reach? Who is your target audience? Okay? Who are they? Not just the demographics of it, right? The age and marital status and occupy that stuff. More than that, you need to know what's of interest to them. Okay? So think about it. How can you find that out? How can you find out what your target market is truly interested in? And don't guess it. That's the worst thing you can do, right? There's all sorts of ways to do that, okay? And the simple, one of the simplest ways is to go into forums, okay? And look what's being talked about, okay? Or go to places like Amazon Book Reviews, okay? About a particular topic that you are interested in, that's right in your alley, in your niche, okay? And look at the poor reviews, not the positive ones. Look at the poor reviews of a book about a topic in your niche. And you'll see there where people are expressing dissatisfaction because their particular need wasn't met by the book. And you've got it right there, okay? You've got to find out what people truly are looking for. That's what you need to know about your target market. Then, as far as your content creation is concerned, you've got to be able to engage that target audience. Now, whether you create a blog post, whether you create a podcast, whatever it may be, you've got to be engaging them. You've got to get them interested. You've got to be able to get on their wavelength and talk to them in such a fashion that they think, wow, this guy truly understands what I'm on about. This guy truly understands what I need, what my problems are. Once you've got to that stage, you've got a reader on your blog, you've got a listener on your podcast, you've got a visitor to your website that truly thinks you can help them. Number three, to get them there in the first place, you've got to get their attention, right? Think about it. How can you get their attention? Look at your site right now. Is your message clear? When people come there, can they see what you stand for, what you believe in? What are the values you can bring to people? What is the target market that you are looking to help? So people, can, can they either relate to that or not? Now, they, if they can't relate to it, fine, you don't win them all, right? But they will be able to see your message very clearly, who you are, what you stand for, what values you can bring to people, what problems you can solve, what's the sort of people you've helped in the past. That clarity of message is very important to you and your sales future, I can tell you. So... If you're going to write good content, one, make sure you create the best content you can. Two, make sure you engage with your target market. That means you know who they are and you answer the problems you've researched and found out that relate to your target market. And three, give them a reason to read your blog content, to listen to your podcast, whatever it may be. Give them a call to action that's irresistible. Give them a reason to say, I want to hear what this guy, this lady's got to say. There you go. If you do that, I can tell you, you will create content that is listened to, that is read, that is of interest to people. Just get your message extremely clear. All right, that's my message for today. If you found it helpful, and I hope you did, okay, come and join with me. Come and join my Thai Village Marketers Tribe. There's lots more just like this, right? I've got all sorts of free video training, free reports, etc., 
and I would welcome you to join with me today. I mean, if you join with me today, I can get you started, for example, with 25 hot ways to drive free targeted traffic to any website you want. It's there, right? Right waiting for you. So I look forward to helping you and your online future, okay? All the best for now. Join with me today, and I'll see you soon. Okay, bye for now.